Hi Libra, this is your reading with me. We are going to have a look and see what is coming through. I hope you are doing well. If not, I hope I can help you. All right, so um, before I start, actually, I actually just wanted to mention welcome. And um, also, if you would like to win a free reading with me, all the information on how you can enter is only in the description box of the video. So I just wanted to mention that because there's random scammers and things lurking around. So, you know, just be aware that everything is linked to my official YouTube channel, including uh, where you can purchase private services, intention items and things like that, which is only on shopmoonlightguidance.com. Oh, and I also have an Etsy store as well. I forgot to mention that too. <laughs> yeah, my Etsy store as well, which by the way is all linked to my, um, my um, channel. So, you know, there's um, the private services like tarot readings, there's rituals to manifest different areas of your life, there's black magic energy removal, and so many other things on my website. But there's also the intention items, which are also on Etsy, thousands of five star reviews on those, which you can check out on both platforms. And also, you know, these are items for various areas of your life. They're handmade, meditated with in sage. There's bracelets, necklaces, anklets, pom-poms, tassels, embroidered cards, which you can put under your pillow, your wallet, or your purse, sage bundles, candles, teas, etc. So everything is really there. All right, so let's begin and see what's coming through for you. Libra. Ooh, nice. Nice. Okay. Wow. Talk about divinely guided. So Empress actually carries your energy, believe it or not. Now, whether you're male or female, look, I read energies in tarot, not specifically genders. Okay. So you can be male, you can be female, you know, however you may identify your energy comes through with the Empress. Okay. Empress is ruled by Venus. Libra is ruled by Venus. You are literally ruled by the planet of love. And when I say that in this lifetime, you will have love that is divinely guided, where you are loved and appreciated wholeheartedly for who you are, that is something that is absolutely happening. The Queen and the King of Cups here shows that there is um, real progress actually in your near future of someone coming towards you and being very, very emotionally validating. Now, this means that they are very healthy emotionally, they understand themselves emotionally, and they also want to communicate with you in a very healthy manner, which is not start, stop, start, stop, or hot, cold, hot, cold, push, pull, push, pull. This is actually very flowing, it's very consistent, it's very progressive, they respond to you as and when they can, but they're also very realistic with you, and they're very understanding, and they would be by your side and support you tremendously and be there for you in many ways, how you need them to be there for you. They can be predictable. You know, this is the kind of person that's going to like, you know, when you, when you text them, they're going to respond to you. So some of you might like literally think to yourself when this happens, because you've been in situations where, you know, it's hot and cold and then you have to like think about when they're going to message you. And, and then it's like that sort of like, um, you get that hit of adrenaline, you know, when they do message you and then you have to think of the next thing you're going to say, and then you're waiting, you know, it's not like that. That's the thing is that this person, even though they're predictable and you might be like, oh, it's just quite predictable. Yeah. They're just going to message me back. It's healthy. Repeat after me. It's healthy. This is healthy, right? And so many people, they get really attached to situations that are hot and cold and things like that. But you know, in, in many ways, and then they find um, connections that are like this a little bit boring sometimes, but do you know what? That predictability is exactly what you want. And you want that consistency. You want that love. You want that appreciation. You will find this person physically very attractive. And I also see here as well that the King and the Queen of Cups shows that you will be able to laugh together, cry together, <laughs> you know, uh, do fun things together and still be feeling like you are, you know, a solid power couple. So it's so beautiful actually to see that there's so much good energy here and it's really exciting in all honesty. Wow, you've got the sun as well. This is a really beautiful relationship that is going to unfold for you in the near future. The sun here shows that this person carries a real soulmate energy. They are so kind and so considerate. They have been working so heavily on their finances and that's why things have been lagging. <laughs> you know, they've been a bit slow in certain areas, but so beautiful. The hanged man. Whew. My gosh, you know, I just, I, I have shivers. I just, oh, this has never happened in a reading before. You probably can't even see it, but like there are goosebumps there. Oh my gosh, oh my goodness. 
Ooh, anyone else feel the goosebumps? This is really beautiful. Okay, so two of wands with the ace of swords and the three of pentacles. Are you kidding? This is so beautiful. So two and the three of pentacles here shows progress. The ace of swords here shows that they would just know that you are the right person for them. They would just be super, super aware that they want to progress things with you. They want to move things along with you and that they see a real future with you as well. I mean, I am just so, so excited to see this for you. You know, there's a real sense of just you feeling so balanced, as we see here, so calm. There's a real sense of happiness. You know, twos also represent balance and harmony. A lot of you may be seeing the number two as a repeating number combination, you know, around you. Uh, or you might be seeing pairs, you know, pairs of things, for example. Um, and that just means that, you know, there is a beautiful balanced relationship that is mutual coming your way. And the Ace of Swords shows this victory is going to come soon. Okay, even with the sun as well, there's a real sense of happiness. A lot of you are already picking up on the fact that something major is going to happen in your love life soon. And you are correct. Three of Pentacles really shows teamwork, harmony, balance, fulfillment and joy. Of a beautiful relationship that is going to manifest and give you so much happiness. Hanged Man is absolutely stunning because the Hanged Man is Neptune energy. Neptune, of course, is really about a beautiful spiritual connection coming to fruition, which I believe is a soulmate connection. And the Page of Cups, it's surprising, but it's honestly so beautiful and loving because this I see as a child. So there is definitely a child energy here because you've got kind of like the let's say the parents and then the child here um, and there's just such a beautiful energy of you feeling happy now we've definitely got a strong cancer pisces scorpio energy coming through in the reading so i did definitely want to mention that but um yeah oh my gosh goosebumps right i literally still have shivers this is so beautiful and um this person's going to be very mutual and understanding they're really going to wash away a lot of the pain that you've suffered and had in the past um, because they don't want to manifest that towards you and they just want to be their own self, if that makes sense. They don't want to be rude, abrupt, mean. You know, they're just going to be how you need them to be, which is healthy. So your affirmation here is, I'm ready for a healthy relationship. I'm ready for a healthy relationship. Because this is healthy from what I'm seeing. This is exactly what your soul has been craving. Yeah. Okay, so let's go with the oracle cards. <laughs> take that one because it was like almost coming out so you've got codependency addictions are affecting your romantic life remember what i mentioned before is that some of you have been holding on to situations that are let's say not healthy um you know where you are addicted to messaging someone who is just not very nice to you or hot and cold towards you or that you feel addicted to well i see here that actually that can also be affecting your romantic life where you feel that that's all you deserve but actually, there's a really beautiful connection here that's also coming through, which as a result of letting go of codependency and also, well, more so actually healing it. When I say letting go, I do mean healing. Um, it just seems to uplift what comes into your life, which I think is really interesting. So addictions here of any sort as well, um, being able to heal and work on them really, really impacts and brings your love life to so much more of a content energy. Romantic feelings. Okay, so what I'm seeing here specifically is that you're going to be exploring a beautiful, beautiful relationship where there is going to be true love, appreciation and understanding with a person that absolutely gets you and wants to get you. They are not someone who is committed to misunderstanding you and being rude and abrupt to you. A lot of you need to heal from the past. There you go. Okay, this one says release your ex. So releasing from past situations in order to experience much more love in your present moments because a lot of you are really plagued by your past it's the only thing that just is in your energy field and until you aren't able to heal from that especially because we have got codependency um you know this seems to be pending in your destiny and you deserve so much better from what i'm seeing here libra because you have not been treated 
like 100% of how you should be treated if that makes sense you deserve so much better treatment and so much better happiness and that you will get so long as you also believe that you want it right I think that's important and this person is someone who you can be with for the long term because we also have here engagement it just goes to show you that they do want to be with you they do want to progress things with you and that you are not going to be unloved in this lifetime and that is what we have there. So this is your reading Libra. Now, if this resonates with you, let me know in the comment section below. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to my channel and check out the description box below since we do giveaways um, every single month. Also, if you'd like to purchase any personal readings or things like that, intention items, etc., everything is listed down below and on my website. I also have TikTok and Instagram. If anyone wants to follow me on that, feel free to do so and I'll see you all very soon. <laughs> Bye everyone. Bye.